to different creatures. Remember, she's emotional, he's logical. So a man is stimulated by what he sees. A woman by what she hears. When a man sees a woman, it impacts him. When a woman hears a man, it impacts her. Two different creatures. So because of that, a male has a natural desire to look for beauty. Secondly, because he's, a, he's aggressive, he has a natural desire to want to protect what is his. So this, this combination produces a spirit of a desire for an attractive wife. He wants something that is beautiful and something that is worth protecting. He doesn't want an attractive wife. He needs it. Now remember Jesus Christ is representing the male and the church represents the wife. Huh? If you study, you study it there again in the book of Ephesians 5, it says what? Husband, love your wife like Christ loved the church. What does he do? He cleanses her, washes her, takes away spot, take every wrinkle, every blemish, right? And he presents her to who? Himself, not to the father, himself. Why? He wants to be proud of his wife. All of you all talk often about this Proverbs 31 woman. Now my wife and I are going to be writing a book next year. Both of us write this book. The book will be titled, The Proverbs 31 Man. You need to study that man. That is also about that man. And if you study that woman, she understood that man. It says that she dressed in tapestry and fine. You know, I mean, she, was, she, she knows how to put herself together. He was proud to sit in the gate of judgment. In other words, he went to work bragging and said, that's my wife, man. Look at that woman. Woo, that's my wife. He was proud to take her out in the public. Some men hide their wives. Stay home, baby. Stay home. Stay home. Stay home. Pray at home. A man needs an attractive wife. So he can present her to himself. So ladies, it's not for pressure. If you know that he needs that, then supply that need. Look good all the time. If you wear rollers in your hair, let your rollers look dignified. <laughs> I'm serious about this. I've seen women, man, God have mercy. They go out to, you know, go to the store, slippers, dirty clothes, hair and rollers, praise the Lord. They don't even walk with dignity, you know? <laughs> Fella comes home from a hard day's work, wife opens the door, <laughs> and he... <laughs> she got frying pan in the hand, knife in one, <laughs> grease all over her hair. <laughs> Welcome home, baby! Attractive wife. <laughs> you know what the Bible says? Listen, you know, you know what the Bible says? Uh, are we okay? Is everybody okay? Can I go a little bit, long, little bit longer? Okay. Listen, watch this. In the book of Genesis, very interesting. It says about a woman and a man. It says, For this cause should a man leave his mother and father and cling to his wife. Now, the word cling there, when I studied it, it blessed me. The word cling is the Hebrew word which means to chase after. Now, this is very interesting. The Bible says, for this cause should a man leave his mother and father and chase after his wife. Now, it says chase your wife. Now, normally you chase the woman you want to marry, don't you guys? You chase her. And when you catch her, you stop running. Why? She stopped. That's the problem. She used to dress up before you got married. She always smelled good before you got married. She put on her best. That's why you wanted to be around her. You couldn't be without her. You chased her. And then when you caught her, she stopped doing what made you chase her. Right now. 
My wife is a smart woman. I'm going to talk about my, I, I know mine, so I talk about mine all the time. My wife looked better now than before we got married. I mean, there ain't no hope for me. <laughs> I wake up, I want to chase her. I chase around the house all the time. Come here, girl. <laughs> You're supposed to look better after you get married. Fix yourself better after you get married. Look better, dress better, smell better. I mean, make, make him look at no one but you. But most women, child, I done got him. What are I going to go diet for? I already got him. What are I got to go do with all this stuff? I Just as I am. <laughs> and you're wondering why the guy is coming home late. Because the view is not too interesting. mercy what is a woman's third need she needs this honesty and openness what does she need honesty and... men listen carefully women don't want this they need this it's fuel if you want a woman to function for you be honest with her all the time and be open tell her everything that you need to tell her and don't ever tell any other woman something you didn't tell your wife that's a heavy advice. No woman should know anything more than what you know. Be open with your wife. She needs it. A woman will glow when she feels she got your intimate secrets. Be honest with her. If you get a plan for business, tell, tell your wife. Don't tell no other woman. Be honest. A lot of women are living in marriages and they feel locked out. The husbands talk to everybody else except them. And they feel locked out. And they are malfunctioning. You have to be honest with your wife. My wife and I have Thursdays that are belongs to us. Thursday belongs to us in our marriage. Thursdays. Thursdays, we don't see nobody. We go on a date every Thursday. 24 years. Thursday, we talk. That's what we take. I give her all that's in my heart. All my plans for the future, everything I'm thinking about, some of the problems I'm going through, difficulties and challenges I'm going through. She gets to know this. Well, I got to be honest and open with her. I know she needs that. Jesus is the man. The church is the woman. Huh? You know what he says to the woman? Cast all your cares upon me. He says what? I will keep no secrets from you. I've told you everything, he says. She needs that. Number four, a, woman, a man needs what? Domestic support means when he comes home, he don't want to start over again with a busy day's work. Home's supposed to be a refuge for a man, a hiding place. A cave to hide in. A place where he can be away from the world that's so hard on him. He needs domestic support. 